topping tonight's news, friends and family of 16-year-old Chase Price are talking about the Hillcrest High School student. Price was killed in a fatal wreck in November of 2016. The other driver, 55-year-old Kevin Henderson of Condale, faces murder, DUI and other charges. He was indicted last week by a grand jury. WVUA 23's Joel and Bukovac spent some time with some friends of Price, including his girlfriend and a woman that used to work for Henderson. She joins us live now with more. Joel and Tamika, the car crash that happened almost two years ago left heart shattered. Price's friends and family told me they are relieved that Henderson is finally facing the consequences. When I learned that the man who killed Chase was, you know, put in jail, it doesn't make it a whole lot better because he's not here. Like he took something from all of us that's not replaceable. 16 year old Chase Price was driving home from work when 55 year old Kevin Henderson's car collided with his, killing the teenager. Brandy Levins, a family friend, was working for Henderson at the time of the accident. Sherry, his mother, and I have been friends since we were little. We were at the beach. Chase was supposed to be with us. He changed his mind at the last minute. Now Henderson is facing murder charges as well as reckless driving, speeding, and DUI. I feel relieved. Chase deserves that, and I'm very happy he's off the streets. These charges won't undo what has already been done. When I found out, I felt confused to why it had to be him and how someone could be ignorant enough to make a decision that bad. Chase's friends wanted to gather at the scene of the accident and share some memories. I met Chase when I first came to high school. We played high school football together. Um, and he was just a life of the party. Every time like anybody was around him, he was just really outgoing and, and he was never like afraid to be himself. Chase's friends believe they have learned something about life. It shouldn't be taken for granted. Loved each other. <laughs> Don't leave your family without telling them you love them because you never know when you might not ever see them again. His friends and family have made a beautiful memorial at the site of the accident. They told me that this is a place where they can go and talk to Chase. Live in the studio, Joylyn Bukovac, WVUA 23 News.